you know, if an event involves animals, Jackie and I are all over it. And there's one coming up on Friday that is really a major event. Absolutely. Sherry Percreto joining us, uh, a volunteer for Furry Friends, an organization we're very happy to have on our program quite often. But one of their biggest fundraisers is coming up this Friday, and we're very excited to be a part of it. But we want to make sure the public knows to come and enjoy as well. So good morning. Thank you for Thank joining you. us. Thank you for having us. Uh, first, let's talk about Furry Friends and why this is a, a passion of yours to get involved with. Well, we are a, a no-kill animal shelter. Um, we are one of the first in the area to be a um, open admission for the Des Moines community. So we take in animals from uh, Urbandale, Clive, West Des Moines, and uh, Windsor Heights. And uh, so we um, really are happy that we can save animals. We've been taking animals actually from the hurricane um, areas. Okay. Uh, we take wow. in several dogs, um, dogs of what we've been taking mostly, um, mm -hmm. uh, weekly actually. So um, we're trying to save them as well. Um, they don't know which, you know, where they've come from. Right, uh, we, they're so out of sorts. They're so out of sorts yeah. and many of them are heartworm positive. So we've been taking care of that as well. Um, and it's 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 a challenge. So now we, where we you guys set up for those people who aren't familiar with Furry Friends, uh, where are your locations? We are at uh, 1211 Grand Avenue, uh, West Des Moines. Okay. Okay, one of the main locations there. And you yes. guys are continuing to expand in other neighborhoods as well. But if we people want to maybe see the animals that you uh -huh. have available or see what you guys are 12 about. 1211 Grand. 1211 Grand, but also the website, website. a great place to go. The website has all of well. our, our current animals on there, um, all their names and um, approximate dates of birth or, you know, age. Um, and kind of uh, a little snippet about them. It's a great organization. And again, in order to stay functional, you have to have fundraisers. And that's mm -hmm. what this one coming up on Friday is. And this is a pretty big deal. This is the seventh time you've done this. It is. This is uh, Wags and Whiskers is the name of our event. Um, it's Friday, October 12th uh, at Decades Event Center uh, from 7 to 10 p.m. And tickets are $45. You can purchase them at the shelter um, at eventbrite.com or um, from me. <laughs> or just come over there. For those people that aren't familiar with Decades Event Center, you, maybe you've never been there. It's the old Dolls location right. on Grand. Everybody mm -hmm. knows where that is. Right. Uh, you know, Picker Nose is on one side, and then Decades Event Center is on the other side. And boy, what a great facility that is, too. A, a great space for a yeah. wonderful event. But take us through, if we've never been a part of it, take us through the evening of what people can experience when they come out to Wags and Whiskers. We have um, probably 80-some baskets that we... Um, set on tables mm. and have everyone wander through as they enjoy the evening. There's uh, appetizers uh, and some drinks that they can have and, uh, you know, casually walk through, make a bid on things. And then we also have uh, some live items also. Um, we have um, a great trip to Utah that's uh, really close to Best Friends uh, Animal Sanctuary. We have that bicycle that's um, a, bike a, table. That is really neat. Again, <laughs> is uh, this is the anniversary of when the, the bicycle frame was patented on this day. Uh, so oh. that was kind of Oh, is that cool. right? Yeah. yeah, so it's a good tie into that too. Okay. So uh, what, uh, that, that is really a neat <laughs> I know, thing. that's a cool piece. That's a lot. There's a lot of bike fans around here that are going to yeah. be looking and bidding on that. One too, well, I, I hope so. Yeah. I hope so. It's so a bike table, with bike bar table for bar stools. Bar yep. for bar stools. That's okay. awesome. So that's an example of some of the auction items. We have a couple more images we can show you. Of course, with, <laughs> yeah. when it comes to free friends, you got to have some great uh, dog things, dog related yeah. items, Pet, and yeah. great art pieces as well. Yep. We have uh, cat food and cat litter for a year is one of the donation or one of the baskets, and we have this. That dog is three foot tall. It is really. <laughs> oh my yep, yeah. That is really neat. <laughs> what a fun, unique piece! And I think a, a couple other images we can show you of just some other things that you might want around uh, your home and yep. homemade items. One of our volunteers, actually, who is uh, quite a carpenter, um, created those. Uh, Cocktail tables and end tables. What um, a unique piece that is. Yeah, they're yeah. called the live edge. So the edge is not you know square and flat. It's uh, it's the shape of the tree, if you will, and then created the metal as well. So. Oh, I love it. So yeah. you're going to find things you can't find anywhere else. Exactly. Uh, part of the silent auction and live auction items that are going to be available and right. truly unique baskets. You guys do an incredible job of really creating experiences that people can bid on, but there'll be beverages yes. and lots of food mm -hmm. for people to yep. enjoy while mingling, learning more about the organization, but just having a great evening of fun. Now, we yep. mentioned uh, some of the other items that are there uh, uh -huh. up for auction, and uh, people are familiar with the name Ding Darling. Right. and what a, a talented artist they are. And uh, they provided something for you that's really has a unique stamp on it. 
It does. Um, the family, um, Ding Darling passed away several years ago, but the family has released this um, print that has never been released before. It's a dog print, and then we have number one out of 50 um, available. Number one. Number one. All right. Out of 50 available for the auction bid. It's a oh, probably 11 by 14 piece, um, and uh, I think I sent a picture of it, but it might not have come through, but anyway. But still, this is a very a cool unique yeah. item that mm -hmm. really will benefit animals, that the dog print will benefit the animals at Furry Friends. Absolutely. And that yep. is great. Yep, help us raise a lot of money, which is what we need to do to save even more animals. Absolutely, mm -hmm. okay, and you can see more of these items if you head over to your social media site. You guys have it listed mm -hmm. on your Facebook page, we things do. like that, so if you wanna kind of peruse some of the other items that are gonna be part of the auction, we encourage you to do so. But again, if you want tickets, we encourage you to get those in advance as well. Yep, that'd be great. Okay, and they need mm -hmm. to go where? To eventbrite.com, to the West Des Moines Shelter, or they can purchase them at the, tick, mm -hmm. at the door. All okay. Right. And when you come over too, they can tell you about the new place they're putting together and give you the details on the new facility. The and new facility, yes, mm -hmm. at 3505 uh, Mill Civic Parkway. It's kind of kitty corner from the West Des Moines Police Department. All right. Okay. So <laughs> conveniently right. located as well. Yes. So again, we you, the work you do is absolutely amazing, fantastic. <laughs> Thank you so much for everything. Thanks for having me. And we look forward yeah. to seeing you on Friday night because we're right. going to be there. Yes, yep. you'll okay. be there. <laughs> All right, thank All right. you so much. <laughs> thank you.